Uh, I just wanted to uh, see where we were with those text messages from that subpoena. Oh, it has uh, been 24 yeah. to 48 hours. Yeah, uh, Vinny was actually working with Vanessa on that um, because he came back and was working under the law firm and he was taking that case. So I will reach out to him and see what's going on and get that to you as quickly as possible. I do apologize for that delay. Oh, it's, it's quite a delay. It, it is most certainly, and they were both made aware of that. So I apologize that it hasn't been handled. I will I mean, reach out to him. Well, here's here's the issue I have, though, ma'am. It's it's a, a court order, like this signed by a judge. I don't understand what needs to be worked no, I, on. No, I completely agree. Um, the uh, this is just an issue of delegation because I had so much on my plate. I asked Vinny to handle it for me, and it hasn't been taken care of yet. So I will reach out and get that to you. Why well, I, I don't? I do why is this so difficult to to get pictures? and share the evidence like i don't understand why i would even need to take that I, long i i'm not sure i i couldn't tell you it was a matter of i believe the time difference um as far as like sleep schedule um which is why we had requested the additional time so that miss parker could sleep on her regular schedule um and be able to provide that to you i'm not sure why that has not been done Oh. I mean, it seems a whole lot like failure to comply with the court order. Nope, I understand that completely, which is why I am not having any issue as far as reaching out to them. Um, I will send an email that I can CC you into and see if they can provide that to you. Um, again, this was just a matter of me needing to get delegate because I had so much on my plate with everything else going on that I requested Vinny handle this one with Ms. Parker and it should have already been handled. So I will get on top of that. Okay. I've reached out to both of them. Um, I'm not sure where they are in the case, but I will hunt them down and make they got, sure they, Here's the they part that I don't understand. Like, where do you need to be with it? It's like, it's not not anything where you need to be anywhere with. It's, it's simply for the, the information that was subpoenaed. Right. No, I think that as what I mean by that as far as where they are with it, I, I don't know how many messages may have been exchanged uh, or the time that it takes for her to get all of those screenshotted if, granted if it's a short conversation like if somebody were to subpoena the records between you and i that's a very short conversation but if this is something where they were speaking frequently um for an well, i don't period i don't of time, think it's something that they were both. speaking frequently about during questioning she she indicated that she only ever had contact with the one so if she just swore to me no contacts with the others that would be something okay um i Again, I don't know because I have not seen her phone. Um, I will see what I can do and reach out to the two of them and make sure I get a response and make sure that I get those messages in my hands so that I can forward them because the intent of our law firm is not to be difficult in working with you. I definitely want to comply with any court orders um, and I know that I advise my clients to do the same. So I don't know what's taking so long. I know that Vinny had meetings with Gunny and with the DA, and I believe with also Judge Morningstar. Um, I don't know um, if that's what the delay is, but I need you to put your hands up and you're being the placed under arrest at this time. Four. Uh, we're gonna get Morningstar and the judges down here, but at this time you are to be placed under arrest for obstruction. You gave us a deadline for 48 hours max. Uh, phones on our possession, therefore you are now under arrest for obstruction. And Vinny's no longer a lawyer. He, uh, okay. he does not have to even have his bar license anymore. Well, that was not the case a few hours ago. I'm not going to fight this. She soft got that in hard cover. I'll get the judge. Uh, you want to go to an interrogation room, ma'am? Sure.
Hello, Lieutenant Kelly Price, Blaine County Sheriff's Office. Oh, what's up, Norton? What can I do for you? There's a guy at the front of PZ.